I would feel like now you're now I'm recording. That's what I'm thinking. It says no viewers. Okay. I don't know. Better <laughs> But I don't know. But I don't know. trying to deport him today. Mm -hmm. He's a good man and a wonderful father and he doesn't deserve this. He's a human being and he has a family who he loves very much and we go to the end of the earth for him. Not one more deportation. Not one more! No 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 one more. No one more. No one more. No one more. No one more! 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 Not one more. 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 Not one more.
jamás será vencido. El pueblo unido 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 jamás será vencido. The people united will never be defeated. The people united will never be
de gente inocente sean cerrados. No queremos que se lucre con el dolor ajeno. We don't want to get this kind of corporation that they are causing a lot of suffering to people. When I say shut down, you say ICE! Shut down! ICE! Shut down! ICE! When I say shut down, you say Geo Group! Shut down! Geo Group! Shut down! Geo Group! When I say shut down, you say ICE! Shut down! ICE! Shut down! ICE! Shut down! ICE! Shut down! ICE! 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 Right. How's it feel to have your freedom taken? 
Okay. All right. Thank you. What do we want? Justicia. Ahora. 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 humanos, todos los seres humanos en la tierra somos iguales, nadie tiene el derecho de quitarnos nuestra libertad y ponernos en la cárcel sin, sin, un, sin causa de ningún delito, si nos, nosotros los humanos no hacemos respetar nuestros derechos, ¿quién lo va a hacer? We have to, to respect our human rights, we, we are humans, we have to defend our own rights, 
tenemos que defender nuestros propios derechos. Tenemos que ver si hay alguna injusticia como tener a gente que no hizo nada y que está detenida en estos centros. Tenemos que luchar, tenemos que ver por lo que se está haciendo mal, porque son humanos como nosotros sin ningún, de, sin ningún delito. Legalization, not deportation. Right? No? Oh, I'm here. Yeah, the, I'm here because I'm tired of waiting co for Congress or anybody else to do something right. So it's time for us to say to Obama and to elected officials everywhere here in Washington State to, that we need to stop deportations, we need to stop dividing families. It's time for them to do what they're supposed to do. They're supposed to be working for us. They're representing us. We're paying our taxes. We are supposed to be represented in Congress and in Olympia and everywhere else, and we are not seeing them doing nothing. So that's why we're here. We're blocking this place, and we're going to stop activities at the Northwest Detention Center, a.k.a. jail, for the dignity of our people. Everybody should be out here being outraged that we have up to six 1,600 people inside there, separated from their families, being divided and being treated like numbers or like boxes that uh, this group, GEO Incorporated, is making tons of profits out of us. They're making millions of dollars every quarter out of our misery. Just because we're lacking one little piece of paper, we're treated like criminals and they're making money out of us. We get charged for everything inside there, and we're just placed there in order to meet numbers, a bed quota that Congress set up, so it's very convenient for GEO Incorporated to be profiting of this system. And it's time to stop it, and it's time to be outraged and angry and do something, and that's why I'm here. That's right. <laughs> Mothers, fathers, kids are deported today, and I want to do everything I can to stop that and to send a message to President Obama that he can use his power to end deportations now. He can do that now, and doesn't have to wait for Congress to shuffle their feet. Um, and I grew up on a, in a border county and watched my neighbors being um, harassed by Border <coughs> Patrol, and I don't want to see that happen anymore. So I'm here standing with other people, and I hope that I hope that the folks inside know that we're here, and I hope that our message is heard by President Obama. Sin papeles, sin miedo. Sin papeles, sin miedo. Sin papeles, sin miedo. No papers, no fear. 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 Sin papeles, sin miedo. Sin papeles, sin miedo. Sin papeles, sin miedo. Undocumented and unafraid. Undocumented, unafraid. Undocumented, Oh, I should 
conversation incriminating. <laughs> like my name is. My social security number is. <laughs> Do you want to talk about why you're here? Okay. Uh, in a minute, let me tweet. First. Okay. All right. Hopefully they got that. Just kidding. I mean, follow me. Do somebody of here want to talk? Want to? Do somebody of you want to say something? That bad things happen here and nobody say nothing. The human errors live in some of them. They don't care, but we care because we know uh, the understanding of the civilian people. They kept my dad in the same uniform for a month straight. That's not fair and that's not right. No se vale que estén deteniendo gente inocente y que y los criminales que están afuera no les hagan nada. No se vale que lucren con el dolor ajeno. No se vale que dejen a los niños huérfanos. No se vale que solamente por el solo hecho de estar buscando dignidad en, 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 en el trabajo los detengan. No se vale. Do you want to talk about why you're here? Down, down with deportation. Um, up, up, liberation. I am down, here because this is my community up, up, and I believe down, that down, there's down, such thing as aliens or immigrants or all humans. Down, down with deportation. Up, up, with liberation. Down, down with deportation. What do you hope that will come out of this action? I hope that it will make people more aware that there is a detention center here and the act that it has on breaking up families along with breaking up Do you want to say a little bit about why you're here? Yeah, sure. Um, I'm here because um, it's a lot. Um, most, most of it is, you know, um, to support um, folks that um, want to get arrested today, but also um, I feel really connected to um, the issue of you know, being deported. Again, um, the family of immigrants, and also I grew up a lot. Um, there was in San Diego where um, a lot of people were deported and uh, hopping the fence because you know, they wanted a better life. You know, we have solidarity with my que vamos a poner la presión necesaria, hacer lo que sea necesario para parar estas deportaciones y tener más adelante una reforma migratoria con dignidad. Y estamos aquí para eso, también educar a la gente que no podemos seguir permitiendo que se haga eh, dinero de nuestra miseria. 
uh, por ser solamente indocumentados, por no tener un papel. Y ya estamos hartos de que nos vean uh, como que de, nos debería de dar vergüenza por no tener un papel. Y no nos da vergüenza, no nos da ver, vergüenza eh, no tener un documento. Le debería de dar vergüenza al gobierno de tener más de 11 millones de personas, las cuales no son reconocidas como miembros de esta sociedad. Y pagamos impuestos y aún si no pagáramos, estamos contribuyendo de miles de maneras. Y es hora de que se nos respete, que se respete nuestra dignidad. Y por eso estamos aquí para detener las actividades del centro de detención y evitar deportaciones. Uh, y es hora de que la gente, tanto documentada como indocumentada, se una a esta lucha y, y, y tengan uh, coraje de lo que está ocurriendo y hagan algo. Estamos ¿Por qué? ¿Por qué aquí hoy? en el centro de detención. Hoy de precisamente porque los lunes son los días que ellos hacen deportaciones. Eh, los lunes a esta hora es cuando sacan los camiones y se llevan a la gente a los aeropuertos. Y por eso decidimos hacerlo justo antes de que empiecen sus actividades de deportación. Tenemos el lunes. aquí familias. Uh, y queremos eh, unirnos a otras acciones que han ocurrido a nivel nacional. Uh, ahorita que ya llega la policía, estamos dispuestos a quedarnos aquí hasta que nos lleven si es necesario arrestados. Uh, y queremos que la gente se dé cuenta de este lugar escondido, que mucha gente que vive en el Estado o aquí en Tacoma ni siquiera saben que existe. Gracias, Gracias. Gracias. Y haya organizaciones que lucran con este dolor ajeno. Queremos que dejen libres a la gente inocente que está aquí detenida. Está llegando más gente aquí que nos viene a apoyar y estamos muy agradecidos con todos. Esta gente tiene mucho corazón, está levantada desde muy temprano, está haciendo mucho frío, algo de viento y lluvia. Pero es más importante que sepa la comunidad que aquí un grupo de gente está luchando por sus derechos. The bus is trying to leave a van, so we're going to see whether or not they can pull that off. Seems like there's two entrances, and we have one blocked off that you all have seen over here. And so we're going to try to see if we can block off this other entrance. Okay. So up ahead here in those gated areas where they keep a lot of the geo buses. Do you want to say a little bit about what happens over here? Sure. So this is a track that holds all the geo vehicles. Geo is the private organization that runs this detention center. Um, and so the buses and the vans that take deportees come out of here and load them up here. What we're seeing now is possibly them trying to leave with a van. We've blocked off J Street, which is this main street over here, um, but there's a side street that they could get out of. We have a woman and her daughter whose husband is being deported this morning, and so they're here putting their bodies on the line trying to stop the van from moving. How's it going over here? What's going on? We're letting cars in, but we're trying to block cars coming out. Don't get run over.
talk about why you're here today? Do you want to tell me a little bit about the deportation center here? Sure. So the Northwest Detention Center opened about 10 years ago, and it started as a about 500-bed facility. Um, and over the past, I don't know, um, 10 years, it's now grown up to be a 1,500-bed facility. Um, uh, you know, the detainees are held here from all over the Northwest, and recently they've actually started bringing up people who they arrest at the border. So about a third of the detainees actually are arrested at the border, ask for asylum. Um, and then, of course, in this country, if you ask for asylum at the border, you get detained, and so they get flown all the way up here, you know, thousands of miles from the Mexican border, um, and they're detained here to fight their asylum cases. So that's about a third of the people here. Another third of people are transferred over from jails. Um, uh, so under programs like secure communities where people get arrested, every time any, you have any contact with the police, now it's possible that you're going to be arrested and, and um, uh, your fingerprints will be run through the system just as a matter of being arrested. Um, and at that point, uh, I puts what's called a hold on you, and even though you should be released from jail when, once your criminal stuff is through, instead you get transferred over to immigration detention. Um, so that's about a third of people. And then about another third of the people in this detention center are being picked up because they have old uh, deportation uh, orders, um, and so these could be orders that are like, you know, a dozen or more years old. Um, and so that's what, that's how people end up here. Sorry about that. How are you doing? What do you hope to get out of today? Um, I think I, My dad comes I, I think that that's, we're, we're here to stop our van, not, not the employees. We need I think it'll be Yeah. Oh, it's true. Yeah. yeah. The way they yeah, treat no, no, it's good. are so think, unfair and poor, <laughs> it's really shameful and sad that they think they're so much better than us or than these immigrants that they can just treat them like shit and stomp all over them and nothing be done. Well. It, we're done not taking action. It's time to start taking action. Things need to be done and things need to change. And my dad needs to come home and so do all those other innocent men need to go home to their families. Is there something that you want the rest of the people who are watching this to know? ICE isn't what you think it is. People say that ICE is to help our country. In all reality, all they're doing is tearing our families apart, and they enjoy it. If you were to see the looks on their faces when they took my dad, you could just see that they enjoyed what they did, and it was really sad that they enjoyed um, so tearing families you. apart. Give me a Where are you going? So I'm going to walk back from the entrance that we were just at to this other entrance where we started out. It looks like there's about 30 people over here. And people keep showing up. We've turned around a lot of cars that have been trying to get in. So far we haven't seen any big buses trying to leave. Como News is here.
simplemente soy una de las personas que in, 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 indiscutiblemente de lo que piensen otras personas de mí, porque estoy en este momento, en este lugar. Eh, anteriormente tú no pudiste venir a este lugar con miedo a ver a mi hermano que estaba detenido en el centro de detención. Ahora perdí ese miedo y estoy acá. Y abiertamente lo digo, soy un doctor. Eh, descríbeme un poco de lo que está sucediendo físicamente en Bruselas. ¿Están encadenados? O qué? Estamos encadenados en este momento, como lo pueden ver, estamos encadenados y aquí vamos a estar hasta que hasta que nos vengan a, a, a desencadenar. O sea que tienen cadenas de hierro allá. Sí. Estamos amarrados, no nos podemos tapar la No more deportations. No more deportations. No more deportations. Si se te ocurre algo, no more deportations. 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 When? No more deportations. Right now. No more deportations. 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 Yeah. No more deportations. No more deportations. No more In, ing in English or Spanish? Whatever you, whichever. Yo, en español. Okay. Este, quiero decir que estamos aquí protestando en el centro de detenciones que es Norwest Detention Center eh, y es el uh, U U Department of Homeland Security. Ahí está y estamos denunciando que es una corporación privada que se beneficia con la detención de gente, de gente inocente. Aquí hay gente que no ha cometido ningún delito. Su único delito ha sido ha sido buscar trabajo, buscar sobrevivir como cualquier ser humano y consideramos que eso no es un delito. Delito es cuando la gente está lucrando con el sufrimiento ajeno. Aquí tenemos familias que están protestando porque su, su esposo o su padre está detenido aquí y consideramos que no es justo porque no son ningunos delincuentes. Consideramos que en la medida que nosotros tengamos, la comunidad pueda defenderse por sí sola, Puede, puede ser más digna, porque una comunidad digna es una comunidad que lucha por sus derechos. Y aquí atrás tengo a, a, a las migras que, que, me están, que me están grabando porque no les gusta lo que hacemos. Pero mientras nosotros estamos aquí luchando por un mejor mundo, ellos están trabajando solamente para obtener su salario. Entonces nuestra lucha, nuestra lucha es más digna porque nosotros luchamos por algo que, que vemos que se está haciendo injustamente. Y es todo. Gracias, amiga.
No more deportation. 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 I've been informed that some of you try to make your way out, but we have to stop doing that. No more deportation. 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 ¿Algo más que quieras añadir? Ah, sencillamente esperamos que la gente eh, le pierda el miedo a ser indocumentado, que salga, que lo acepte eh, y que dignamente con la frente en alto diga soy indocumentado y que y ahora eh, es, sal, es salir a pedirle a Obama que haga lo, a exigirle a Obama que haga lo que debería de haber hecho hace mucho tiempo, hacer la acción diferida y no vamos a parar, esta no es la, la primera ni la última acción que haremos en Washington. Gracias, Mar. Gracias.
We have some live stream here. Anyone want to say anything about why they've come? <laughs> We gotta keep some music over here. Maybe we'll get some. We'll hear from them soon. I'm sure. We are people. We are not illegal. 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 We are people.
about horses like humanize immigration because um, I think it's really easy, especially when we don't live on the border, to not ever see a face um, and thereby to kind of um, dehumanize and demonize the people who are here um, and not understand why they're here and the economic forces behind why they're here um, and understand that the U.S. policies, um, especially with NASA and neoliberalism, are huge uh, push factors that we have created um, and which cause people to need to come here. Um, and so know that we have a lot of responsibility in that and know that, um, yeah, don't always trust the main media and look for your own courses. I think it's really important um, to, to be able to fully understand what's going on. You are in charge for the the people. Oh, oh, that's good. I, think I have a little one. Oh, yeah. I know who it is. holding it down here at the Northwest Detention Center for a few hours. We've got uh, J Street blocked and F Street. There was a couple vans that tried to get through. We're here because these, these detention centers are the manifestation of President Obama's deportation policy. We won't continue to wait for Congress. We want the President to take action now. It's immoral and it's unjust. The President needs to suspend deportation. And the band played on. Look like throughout the day, what are you going to be? I'm basically here to watch and to take notes. Mm -hmm. I'll talk for a second about this. Okay. <laughs> so basically, the idea is around 
different facilities agencies that um, that that officials uh, are imprisoned in, and um, really to use that as a way to call for Obama to take executive action, and action for everybody. If you wanted to find out more about these national campaigns, how would you find out? You would go to the website, National Day Laborers Organization. Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah. Hopefully the news. Hopefully it'll be all over the media. Yeah. <laughs> you can find out. Watch your live stream. Definitely. I'm pretty sure we're on Facebook and we're tweeting too, so you can check that out. Yeah. 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 All different forms of social media. Yeah. People power. People power. here today.
over here to the detention center. So we've been working on that. We have also been working on, obviously, the DREAM Act here. Um, but really, we, what this is about is wanting to get the deferred access to apply to everybody until Obama gets, um, gets immigration reform. And can, you, can you explain so what, like, what deferred action means? Well, deferred action basically means, uh, for now, that uh, in, the, in the state of Washington, but also other places, um, individuals or uh, youth, basically, that have been here and are undocumented and want to go to school, they can um, have their deportation deferred, so basically they're left alone as long as they're fulfilling certain requirements, and we're asking that the same apply to all undocumented people until uh, immigration reform uh, comes to pass. And then how does this connect to what's happening nationally? I mean, you mentioned some of this stuff already. Yeah, I mean, basically Congress is... Um, Reform and President Obama has not called his deportations, and we understand that you know he doesn't have control of Congress, but we do think that he has control over um, halting deportations uh, right now in the executive order. And if you had a call to action to viewers who are watching, or a place to get more information or any messages, what would you want to share? Well, I think that at a local level, I would really urge everyone, uh, whether you're an immigrant or you're an ally, uh, to urge your local uh, legislators. Whatever, whatever types of programs are in your state, to make sure that you're uh, asking them to put a halt to it because this is really breaking up families. Uh, this is really breaking up our communities. And at the national level, I think we really need to keep pressing for uh, immigration reform because, you know, it's really um, uh, enraging that Obama and uh, the Democratic Party courts our Latino vote and at the end of the day does nothing to um, actually get uh, immigration reform. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We are both happy people here and there. What are you all doing over here? What are you all doing over here? I'm hand feeding people. Apple? I'm okay. Okay. How are you doing so far? How's I'm, I'm doing pretty great. What's it like to be out here locked up um, together? It's pretty exciting. We're dancing around, you know. Got people around us, taking care of us, giving us food, wiping our noses. My arm's kind of getting a little tired, but, you know, whatever. Yeah. What keeps you out here through the cold and the rain? Um, all the people that are being deported. I mean, that's what we're doing here, yeah. right? What <laughs> what a friend of mine was deported recently, so I know what it's like. I'm trying to have nobody else be deported. Stand up, fight back! Your rights are under attack! What are we doing? Stand up, fight back! Stand up, fight back!